Peace be with you. Welcome back to the channel for another video, another spiritual download. If this is the first time that you're coming across the channel, I just want to greet you by saying, hey there, hi there, and hello. Nine times out of ten, it's not a coincidence. Ooh, the spirit guided you to the channel. There's a 99.9% .9 chance, which is really honestly a very high percentage, that spirit does have some type of a message here for you, okay? I just pray that you come in discerning what information is for you. Take what resonates as we are usually here just to read the energy. There are going to be times that you hear me put in my two cents by way of what I'd like to consider an impromptu spiritual commercial break, right? If you don't know what that is, just relax. You will find out soon enough if you stick around. If you like the vibe, like, share, dislike, subscribe, whatever you feel you need to do with this channel. I support the energy. But... In reality, if you like the video, dislike it, comment, whatever you do, it does help the channel grow, okay? If you're returning back to the channel, listen, I love you, I love you, I love you, love you, love you. You're back here because something has resonated with you by way of any of these past videos that I've posted and or the readings, right? And nine times out of ten, there's a ten time out of ten chance that you are my soul child. Nine times out of 10, there's a 100% chance I meant to say that you are my beautiful soul tribe. Let's go ahead and just get into this really quick, interesting download. I'm going to do my best to make it short and sweet because I do have a certain amount of spiritual cases that I am required to get out by way of the most high within a certain amount of time because I know that the moon is wanting, it's waxing, it's doing its thing, it's dancing a jig all up and through Mercury retrograde. By way of this Virgo going within energy, Virgo's paving the way in or clearing the way for people to really listen to their instincts, listen to their discernment. Before Libra gets here, you better know what it is that you feel and or why. Got a message called in my appropriate protection. I pray that you've done the same. I call upon the highest of white lights. Archangel Michael, beautiful Archangel Michael, by way of permission of the most high. Yeah, I knew it. Somebody's paranoid, okay? I channeled this energy earlier. And I actually pulled some cards on it. There's a couple, okay? This could be a mother, a father, mother, stepfather, some family members. I got a queen of cups that was crying out and wailing, suffering like from this judgment. Yeah, eight of cups represents um, them leaving you out in the cold or making you feel abandoned in some type of a way. The eight of wands also means that they are wanting to come towards you. It's weird. It's like we abandoned you. But now we want to come towards you to get a new beginning. It's very interesting. These could have been parents, family members. Um, somebody could have tried to take your child, okay? Somebody wanted you to suffer. Somebody did not believe that you were going to bounce back the way you did by way of uh, not suffering the way that they thought is what I'm getting, okay? So you could feel this pull. They're really wanting to reach out to you. They want to know where you are. These people did some type of dark magic. Who is this mother? This mother, this queen of cups is powerful. I mean, this is a dark ass high priestess. Whoever she is, you pissed your mother off and your mother did a lot of witchcraft on you. Ace of Pentacles, yeah, they want to have a new beginning with you. It's almost like we couldn't destroy you. We're in regret. We did it out of anger. We wanted to blind you to the truth of who you were. And then when we left you out in the cold, this is supposed to break your heart and at least stop you from doing whatever it is that you're doing spiritually. But then you didn't stop and now they want to come back in. Okay, listen, newcomers, let me just stop this tape right now, okay? We are about to dip into this real live commercial break here. What the hell and who the hell? This is somebody's parents? Because I pulled cards on it right before I started the video. And I was like, who is this? There's a Leo um, I got a lot of Leo energy by way of a father and or a stepfather. Father or stepfather. I'm also getting people in the family, okay, that work together and now they're calling you in to come in and be family again? Huh? I just heard their spiritual call has been disconnected. The most high has cut the line. I think that you've already grieved the loss of these people. These people left you out in the cold. Who are, who are you? Who am I speaking to? Listen, the nine of cups, they're watching you get some type of wishes being fulfilled. Somebody underestimated your power. Somebody un underestimated, really? Honestly, all truth be told, they underestimated the most high. 
show me this couple whoever they are i pulled some cards i pulled the ten of swords i put the ace of pentacles they wanted a new beginning the eight of cups was them leaving and abandoning you leaving you out in the cold and they did some type of magic over you as well hexing cursing these are parents somebody's under severe judgment i cannot make it up you're a whole earth angel high priestess out here. Somebody did not want you to walk on your path and somebody wanted to come to calmer waters with you. Bear with me as the cards are ass backwards. Maybe these people are feeling ass backwards because I kept getting this download. I'm like, who the hell is this dark ass couple? Like, what is this? And how can a stepfather convince your mother to go against you? Could be your mother that's crying out to you okay for your help maybe she's now under the attack of the stepfather because i believe that that's how the stepfather was for whatever reason um able to get to your energy yeah this is what i'm getting he's not direct to your bloodline i'm getting a father and i'm getting a stepfather you could have had a whole bunch of people working you you could have had a birth father a stepfather a mother yeah working you Mm, give me a minute. This is real deep, y'all. I really got to stay and channel this energy, but do it in a way that I don't wear myself out energetically because these people are draining. Yeah, Holy Spirit, Divine Ancestors, please put a shield of protection around me and the beautiful Divine Collective and the watchers of this video. Please block, stop, and drop anybody trying to open up a demonic door and send us negative energy, evil eye. We return it to sender times 10. Ooh, These people are going through hell. This is this could be a wealthy man, somebody very well endowed by way of just possessions is what I'm getting. Uh, um, uh, a leader, a boss, uh, yeah. Show me this father, this stepfather. I'm getting stepfather, Archangel Michael. Show me the stepfather. I was picking up a Leo, somebody very dominant. Yeah, death. Somebody's passing away. The stepfather is going to pass away. <sighs> this person's afraid to pass away, y'all, because they are afraid that they won't get a favorable judgment in death. And it's very likely that they will not. This is somebody that's done a lot to destroy you, a relationship with your siblings, a relationship with your mother, a relationship with your children. This person basically sacrificed or tried to sacrifice everybody uh, out of ego, okay? The death card is here, death is coming. This person could be seeing crows outside of their window. They know that their days are numbered. This person's begging for your forgiveness, but I don't feel as though you feel as though it's genuine. This is somebody that treated you like a stepchild. I'm going to be honest. I'm not getting an endearing, loving, kind person. Somebody that could have worked a lot, felt as though maybe because they were a provider, all right, that that was enough. Um, I don't feel another father figure. Maybe you have a biological father, but I don't feel that person was around. Page of Pentacles, this person knew that your mother had a child with a gift. They knew that you were a high priestess. Now they want to apologize for basically building a whole life off of your energy. Believe it or not, it's a very wealthy guy. Show me the stepfather, Archangel Michael, please and thank you. That death is giving me scorpionic energy, but it's giving me final energy. That eight of wands is wanting to come towards you. Eight of cups after abandoning you. Ace of pentacles, okay. Yeah, they collaborated together. Somebody collaborated. They either they could have used your child against you and the mother, but the ring leader was the father, was the stepfather, okay? He was the puppet master pulling the strings. I cannot make it up. King of Wands, I had pulled this energy before. Heavy on the Leo energy, y'all, because I felt Leo at first. Your mother could be crying out to you. These people are under some type of karma. They collaborated, okay? And even though... um. They did this. Yeah, King of Cups, heavy on the Scorpio, Pisces, and or Cancer and energy. The lovers, they could have done something to your love relationships. Could have wanted people to abandon you. You hear the dogs? Yeah. Somebody's fighting. There's a bark. Somebody, a bark is like, hear me. Ah, I'm talking. Like somebody is really angry that they got... They got manipulated into this. This person was a puppet master, a master warlock, master dark mason. 
is what I'm getting. His father taught him everything that he knows. This is what I'm getting, y'all. Just bear with me as I get these downloads. I know a lot of us right now with this peak of the moon, we're getting downloads and they come through like, blah, 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 blah. like that's how it sounds. Like, it's like, oh, uh, I'm like, wait, hold on. I got to tell my spirit guys, wait a minute. Let me get some damn water <laughs> around here. Not to make light of the situation, but this is really what's going on, y'all. Okay, here we go. Show me the stepfather. Because the stepfather got something to say. All right. Yeah. Okay. Equal give and take. This person could be leaving you something in debt or some type of will or inheritance or something of that nature, or they paid somebody also. Okay. So here's the thing. This person is leaving you something because they feel as though this is what's going to help them transition and or not have to go into some type of karmic cycle and or burn in hell. I'm going to be honest. This person made a deal with the devil. This is somebody real dark, y'all. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. This person did magic over you since you were a child, created some type of illusion over you, wanted to control you, control your love life. This is a weirdo. This is somebody that was enamored with who you were having sex with. It's giving me child molester energy. I'm going to be honest. And I'm not here to trigger anybody. If you're triggered, then maybe there's still some healing that you need to do. Not making light of anybody that has been violated as a child. I need you to understand that I know that I know. So I speak from a place of power and not weakness for you to stay in your sick bed. But if you're triggered, my heart goes out to you. The Eight of Pentacles, yeah, this person paid a dark practitioner, paid a worker to basically put you in some type of poverty okay wanted your children this person it's like the rumple stilt skin like of the dark arts wanted your firstborn and wanted your child knew that the power that you had in your lineage this person's very angry that they're not your father their daughters are karmics okay this person could have had other children with your mother yeah queen of cups i told you it was a fire sign and a water sign your mother could be a scorpio okay yeah yeah, your mother could be a Scorpio by way of that death. That's what it's giving me. They both could be dying. These are older people. This is an old ass witch and an old ass warlock. Like these people are in their 60s and 70s. Okay, they know exactly what they're doing. They're very, very powerful. They could have caused a lot of mishaps for you. They paid somebody to do this. Okay, they paid somebody to affect your life. Eight of Pentacles is toil and labor, working really, really hard to get some form of an outcome. The Hierophant, by way of their energy with the death and the magic, was to create some type of illusion and or outcome. Six of Pentacles, this person was paid a lot of damn money. I just heard 30000 Damn, on an earth angel child that you raised and left out in the cold and abandoned, I cannot make it up. I cannot make it up. There was some money involved in this Huh. The Ten of Pentacles also represents family. This is people that were your family. This is your mother. This is your stepfather. This person could have raised you from a young age. I'm getting three, four, five, six, seven, or eight. I don't know, but I'm getting that your father was absent for some particular reason. This person is a dark ass energetic worker. The Ten of Pentacles represents inheritance though also for me. Maybe there's something that you're supposed to get and somebody did not want you to have it. Why is that Ten of Pentacles here for this dark ass mother? Lord have mercy. Why is that Ten of Pentacles here? Ooh, commercial break. Let me tell you something. If you're carrying a child and you don't want the damn child or you want a man more than you want your child, give the child up to somebody that you think the child could have a decent life with. This is a really spineless, weak ass mother. Okay. This death is letting me know she's absolutely a Scorpio. I'm getting November. Okay, by way of also her coming up with some fire. She's getting she's giving me fire though. So I'm getting Saggy Scorpio placements. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. These people are getting bad karma, bad luck. While you're getting good karma, good luck. Who the hell? What the hell? Okay. They could have paid somebody to try to. I don't know. I'm getting like, take your children or I don't know what the hell possessed these people to do this. Archangel Michael, what is it that I need to see? Let me just tell the story. Yeah. Okay. This three of pentacles is not supposed to be backwards. Why are these cards coming up backwards? Because something is backwards what they ask. They ask backwards. I'm telling you, my cards don't never get turned around like this. And two, it's letting me know that somebody's embarrassed about this story coming out. Um, this person could have did some type of witchcraft on your mother. 
All right. I feel as though she hasn't been your mother for a really long time. Maybe all of a sudden you're like, what the hell happened to my relationship with my mother? Like that. This person turned on you quick. Like it's, I'm getting a fast action. Yeah. Eight of wands is quick, fast. You know, eight of wands appears telling me they, they flipped on you quickly to where you were like, what? Why are y'all treating me like this, like that? Yeah. Now they want a new beginning. Okay. Because you walked away, but they walked away and made you feel abandoned. So you had no other choice but to walk away from being abandoned is what I'm getting. The three of pentacles. Yeah, these are people that collaborated. They could have used your child against you to go against you. Yeah, page of pentacles. They wanted the gifts of your children. These people are under a severe ass judgment by way of lineage. Sagittarius energy, temperance energy. They could have um, something to do with this or maybe this father figure or this mother, this is what I'm picking up. Thank you, Spirit. I just said that. She has Sagittarius highly aspect in her chart. She is absolutely a November Scorpio. The Empress coming up. Somebody has Aries in their chart, Libra and energy, Piscean energy. She wanted about to blind you from the truth. Then when you have a new beginning, the lovers, listen, these people have affected every aspect of your life. They, This stepfather is obsessed in a weird, like, I'm getting pedophile, y'all. Even though you could be a full-grown adult, this person spied on you as a child um, by way of you, you know, and I don't want to get too um, dark because I can see everything, but I'm just going to say this story respectfully or tell the story. But this person could have spied on you while you were getting dressed. This is a weirdo. This is a weirdo. This person comes off real noble. Oh, yes. And I'm this and I'm very well spoken, very respected by the community you know i'm a part of the black aviation club and uh you know i uh, this is this guy yeah but he's he's a whole narc you know what i mean because he's he been doing black magic for the longest over your mother he turned your mother into this dark ass energy she every time she tried to leave something happened and she didn't know what it was and couldn't explain it she he could have affected her stability so she couldn't move forward the page of pentacles represents um, a child is a gift. Yeah, this person saw this mother as having children with gifts. And then when you grew up as a feminine, I'm getting a feminine energy, a daughter, and you had children, they wanted your children. It's like, bring me the boy, bring me the girl, bring me the, like this, this is a, this is a, oh, this fool right here. I got to catch myself before I wreck myself and their energy. I really need to be mindful. Yeah, they're hiding something. Their intuition, they're doing some type of magic, illusions, trying to put a veil over your face. These people did not want you to know that you were a divine being. They wanted to win at all costs. They're upset that you're getting this um, victory. And show me this practitioner, Archangel Michael. They paid this person a lot of damn money. Yeah, this person is under severe judgment. These are some high-ranked ass people, y'all. I ain't gonna even lie. They can hack into computers. They can tap in. They can see where you at, skip, trace. Uh, background, whatever the hell. This person was painting all kinds of illusions. You were supposed to end up in a mental hospital. You were supposed to end up crazy and dead. It ain't nothing else to say. This is what they wanted. Now they're heavy in regret behind doing this, behind doing this action. But are they regretful because they really have feelings for you? Or are they regretful because the plan that they tried to set up for your life by way of trying to play God didn't work? They paid somebody a lot of damn money. A very powerful practitioner. And now this person is sitting up with egg on their face, realizing that you are very divinely protected. Why I told you that Libra and energy going to come whoop some ass by way of the fall and autumn. I don't know what you call it, fall, autumn, but somebody going to fall in the season of autumn. And it's going to be a lot of craziness that ain't going to have nothing to do with you. The Most High saying, I'm done. I am through with these situations they cannot exist no more. These people did this to you your whole life. It's nothing else to say. Only to find out that you're very, very spiritually protected. Very, very spiritually protected. Lord, have mercy. Painting illusions. Wanting to win at all costs. And now they're trying to call you back in to either finish the job and or apologize. But somebody's near death. Somebody's near death. Okay, whoever the stepfather is, I'm getting atheist. This is not the type of guy. I told you I was pulling Leo energy. Very, very, I'm the lion, I'm the king, I'm the, like, real machismo, like, you know, God is a man type of an energy, you know what I mean? Like, oh, he don't mind going up, oh, I'm going up against God, like, what? Yeah, this is not no spiritual man, this is, this is a slave to the devil, 
This man made a lot of money off of your energy, believe it or not, as a child. And now that you're calling your power back, that means you're calling back your ten of pentacles. You're calling back your spiritual protection. Once you were a child, but now you are a full grown adult stepping into your power. And this is what's triggering this judgment, this harsh ass judgment. Lord have mercy. Show me what else I need to see. Anything else I need to say about this couple? I just see one person in this room doing work over you. Okay, and I see somebody else doing work over you in this room. Like they were doing it separately, but together. But at the, at the same time, somebody's under the illusion. Somebody's under illusions. Who put these people under this illusion? Archangel Michael. Show me what I need to see. Show me these people, please and thank you. Who put these two people under this illusion? Yeah, I cannot make it up. They were trapped. Who is this? Yep, a tower. Could have been the mother, the Scorpio mother that did something to this to this King of Wands to control him and to make him appear to be the one that was actually the puppeteer, but she was actually pulling the strings. This is a silent hatred and or jealousy from your mother because of your ascension. Maybe you were going on your spiritual journey. Maybe she started to see that you were awakening and she saw your future and she knew that you would be greater than her. This woman is still suffering behind losing her true love. She don't love this King of Wands. This is this is somebody she got with for stability. Yep. Eight of Swords. Somebody is sick in mental prison. Somebody wanted you trapped. Somebody wanted you crazy. Somebody wanted you to overreact. Somebody wanted you to be in domestic violence. Somebody wanted you to lose your, your mind, your children, your money, everything. This Queen of Cups, your mother went in on you. Scorpio energy. Now there's a tower in this person's life. This person has killed other family members. I don't know what the hell this Queen of Cups is aligned up with, but I'm getting some darkness. Okay, I'm getting dark witch, powerful ass witch. And she went against her own daughter. She absolutely did. And used this King of Wands because let me tell you how sophisticated this illusion is. Initially, it comes up as if he's the one that's working, working, working you. But again, they could have collaborated together. But she really was the one that initiated this destruction for your life. Show me this King of Wands, Archangel Michael. Please and thank you. Please put a shield of protection over me as I channel this energy. Yep. She, he, he, they were in it together. This is a dark ass couple. He was leading her. She was working him. He was working her. He was, everybody was working everybody. And then they teamed up to work against you, to break you down. Because how dare you grow up to be this full blown high priestess. And they were siphoning your energy all this time. This person wanted you depressed. You could have went through times of depression. Your ancestors are like, I don't think so. The seven of wands represents you being spiritually protected and the ancestors are whooping your mother's ass. Whoever this is, listen, the helping hand of the most high is here and the ace of pentacles. Lord, have mercy. Who's going to come up against this? Lord, have mercy. Your spirit team, your ancestors, your spirit guides are saying we don't give a damn who the hell we got the cuts. Your karmic mama, daddy, stepdaddy, cousin, uncle. It's a karmic ass family back in all this BS. This is crazy to me. I'm not surprised, though. I'm just kind of disgusted by what it is that I see. You actually had to go through divine one, whoever you are. Who am I speaking to? Listen, the most high is like stay in your queen of swords, protect your peace at all costs. And I know that you are. You cut their ass off. You could be in a star status. You could be on a platform like myself. I'm getting a lot of divine beings that are coming out of this paranoia. These people were projecting this paranoia. Didn't want people to see you and or hear you. They wanted you to shut up. Somebody prayed to shut your mouth. Okay. The star represents you being seen in the public eye by way of your gift. All right. And the ace of cups is the helping hand of the most high saying, listen, I'm with you. Lord Jesus, Jesus. The ace of pentacles is bigger than the ten of pentacles. So whatever they thought that they were doing against you to stop you has only led them to the probably the worst tower of their life. These people got karmic lifetimes to live out. Do you understand what that means? Like you die and keep coming back through karmic cycles. <sighs> Begging to ascend to the light. Lord, have mercy. Somebody's in purgatory. Somebody feels unsettled about what's going on here in the earth. They're in heavy regret, but it's only because it failed. Okay. Let me just have another commercial break. Little sad ass little apologies like this. Like divine beings. I don't see us being available for them. These people had years. Okay. I'm getting somebody did this for 30 years. Like they were doing things by way of trying to manifest things in your future is what I'm getting. 
Somebody prayed for you not to have love. Whoever this mother figure is, she's hurt over your father. Show me this mother figure. That could have been her twin flame, okay? She got with this man and you weren't a part of the package deal and she wanted to get rid of you. Then she had children with this person and they're all karmics. Because this king of wands is obsessed with you who's not even his direct daughter. You're the stepdaughter. This person's obsessed with you, your energy, and got two karmic-ass, Jezebelian-ass daughters. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. This is a very wealthy man. This person made money off of your energy, divine being. The justice is here. Scales are being balanced out. Spirit says, listen, this is the ultimate mother betrayal. These people cannot sleep at night. I'm getting Ambien. Somebody could be taking more Ambien than what they need to to sleep. And the sleep medication is not working. Just another commercial break. This is what it looks like when the Most High starts smoting that ass. So people that are encouraged right now, because you know you got people right now, they're watching, they're projecting negative energy, they're burning black candles, they got their little dolls in the ground. Listen, just so you know, this is an old ass couple. Now look at their karma. So while you wishing and projecting bad on these divine beings by where this mirror magic, beauty magic, whatever the hell you're doing to affect somebody's self, just know that this is where your ass is going to end up. Just know that this is an old ass very, very professional by way of doing the dark arts type of a couple that's coming down. The most I say, I don't give a damn who it is. What you talking about? I don't give a damn about your rank. You touch my divine baby. You touch my chosen and my, my child survives. So what the hell else are you trying to do? And now you call and now this is the ultimate betrayal. How do you carry a child and then try to sacrifice them to the devil? <laughs> Lord have mercy on us. Because ain't no mercy here for these people. Ain't no rest for the wicked. Listen, two of cups. They want to come in and apologize. I bet the hell you do. Because now they realizing, oh my God, hell is real. Yeah, it's real. This person could be hearing things. The mother could be hearing things. Okay, what she's hearing is, is uh, torment. She could be hearing people screaming, wailing, hollering out, being tormented by demonic forces. It's nothing else to say. Okay, I just heard nervous breakdown. Ooh, my God. Ooh, somebody got to give the message. Holy Spirit, they want to come back in and make some type of offer to you because they're trying to they're trying to save their soul. Now they need you, right? This is what we've been seeing, that these dark-ass people now need your help because they paid somebody that is really, really good at what they do. This man is a wealthy-ass man to drop 30000 50000 100000 to kill you and or take your destiny was nothing for this couple. And now they're coming to the realization that you are everything that the divine says that you are, and they spent a whole bunch of money. So now they want to apologize. Why? Because they need you in order to hopefully ascend to the light. Ain't no light, boo. What are you talking about? These people actually sacrificed you to the devil, not a demon, not a, not a deity. They went to the devil. These are devil worshipers. Archangel Michael, please and thank you. This man wanted money, fame, power, things. Now they're too old to enjoy it. Now they got all this money, child. Lord, have mercy. That's why I tell people, listen. Spirit is saying, continue to go on down the yellow brick road. Walk away. They abandoned you. These people left you out in the cold to die. They absolutely did. You were never supposed to make it this far. And the fact that you're still alive is making them nervous as hell. Show me the practitioner. I just heard the practitioner's uh, easing on down this dark ass path too. Because they're done. Yeah, Queen of Cups keeps coming up. Definitely a mother. The emperor, a leader, Aries. Could be somebody else involved. Maybe they got your siblings involved too. Lord, have mercy. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody wanted a destiny swap with one of these karmic ass Jezebelian stepsisters, half sister. You could have Virgo involved that was involved. Somebody was paid, honey. Somebody was paid. You could have a Virgo sister and an Aries sister. Okay. This Aries is definitely March. I'm getting March 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th. Okay. You forgive her. Yeah, this person's under some type of illusion. They snatched her soul early on. This poor little baby never had a chance. She's just a puppet on a string. They're just using her as a pawn in this demonic ass game. And they're siphoning her children's energy as well. The king of pentacles is this person. This person is very, very stubborn. Very, very like a big ego. You know, I'm hearing, I got a big ego. Yeah, she loved his big ego. Your mother loved the status. She liked the power that this man seemed to have brought. 
he gave her this uh, stability, this established life, this very distinguished. These people got money, y'all. They loaded and left you out in the cold for poverty. You could have been on food stamps. You could have been on Section 8. Not that there's anything wrong with that, but this is how they did you. Like they, feel, they felt as though if you were going to get to this and this was your destiny, they were going to make it as hard as possible to break you down so that you um, either wouldn't survive it is what I'm getting. Thank you, spirit. Yeah, these people did death magic on you, spells, could have, all kind of weird stuff, y'all. This is weird. This mother tried to siphon your sexual energy. Wow. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to take a break after this one. But listen, nine of pentacles. These people are a slow moving energy. They wanted to slow down your, your, your goodness. They're slow. They're very arrogant. They're saying, we, we're going to make sure she comes back to us. Well, yeah, y'all dying. You do realize that. This is a very harsh, painful, and long death. The sun is here. You've gone towards joy, which is being fulfilled. You're being about your father's work, toil, and labor, okay? Ten of Pentacles is here. These people are spying, watching you be in your, in your destiny. And somebody is really, really, like, concerned because somebody actually prayed that you never have love, that all you found was karmic partners that were abusive. Somebody prayed this and requested a practitioner to make this happen. This is sick and disgusting. And now they're heavy in regret. They actually did you a favor, to be quite honest, because all of the lovers that you had up until this point were not divine. They were karmic lessons. So it's a blessing. Yeah, these people are trapped. These people wanted you in jail. These people wanted you to, they wanted you to just be in some type of illegal activity again this is going to upset a lot of people. Why? Because they don't want the sound on this video. These people are high-ranked officials, y'all. This is a real powerful ass group. They can hack into your birth certificate, social security, bank account, whatever the hell. These people got power. They could have done all of that to you. Somebody could have requested your taxes. All right? All of this stuff was just stuff to upset you and make you feel powerful. But then there's the Most High God. Okay, I'm just saying. I just always like to remind people of who the Most High is if they don't understand. This is sickening. Show me the outcome for this uh, situation for this couple. Yep. Leaving their ass in the past. They're coming in quick. They could be trying to communicate with you by way of the spirit realm. They see you in the ether. Somebody sees you as a shining star in the ethers and they know that they had absolutely nothing to do with your star status and or your ascension okay and a star could just be you standing in your shine in your glory you don't have to be on a public platform somebody's on tv and your mother's watching you on television or radio or listen to you on the radio i said watching on the radio well she could be watching the radio because maybe her ass is in this day something ain't right maybe she watching the radio thinking she gonna see a picture Something's been, somebody got smoted in the mind and really honestly does not know their ass from a hole in the ground. And this is all by way of what they projected onto you. The eight of wands is a fast moving action. You're moving up these ranks by way of your spiritual abilities and or your cycles, divine beings. I'm getting, they could have done this to your brother as well and your sister that was not related to them. Like I'm getting, your mother could have come in this relationship with three children from other fathers. Okay, and somehow this, this person turned dark. This is a long relationship, 30, 30, 40 years, 30 something years of, of being married to this person. Yeah, you got into this King of Swords energy though. Aquarius, Libra, and or Gemini could be significant. Maybe you're an Aquarius, maybe you're a Libra, maybe you're a Gemini. You don't have to be, but something that you're standing in is being seen in the ethers and by way of spirituality. They could be looking for another practitioner. This practitioner's like, hell no, mm-mm. They told this couple, these people, this person is the truth. Y'all got to take this judgment. Y'all are about to die a painful, tormenting death. And the devil has come to collect. This mother is a nervous wreck. A nervous mother freaking wreck. <sighs> mm -mm -mm. This person is watching you be an empress. Yeah, watching you manifest at will. Manifest a new outcome. This is you. You made it through. Congratulations. Your, your, your rank is higher than all of these people by way of this right here. I ain't going to even say nothing else. 
These people better wake up with the hell they got going on in these dark ass families and stuff, hiding all these secrets and incest. Look at this. Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, and the Ace of Swords. This is you. Huh? Okay. <laughs> you got people in high positions that want to make some type of deal with you. They want to collaborate with you. But I just heard you're not for sale. You're working for your Abba. Look at this. The Tower and the Lovers. These two people are experiencing probably the worst tower they've ever had in any of their lifetimes. These are karmic ass people. They've killed you in several lifetimes. I see that somebody was poisoned. Opium, I heard. Okay, o opioid or something like that. Yeah. They're watching you step out on faith. They want to be a part of it. They know that they are not responsible for anything good happening to you in your life. They're absolutely responsible for all of the turmoil and or the hardships that you've had to encounter. Yeah, the Knight of Swords is you moving forward. These people wage war on an innocent person. It's nothing else to say. Yep, the devil. Now they can't stop watching you. They're obsessed. A Capricorn could be very, very significant. The faith card is here. You stepping out on your desires, going towards this Ace of Cups. King of Cups represents Scorpio, Pisces, and or Cancer. You could be a water sign. You could absolutely be a water sign. Okay, I'm getting masculine when it comes to that. Why is the devil here, Archangel Michael? Why is that devil here? Yeah, these people. Yeah, somebody made one of your children a slave. Yep, and now they're broken hearted. Somebody took one of your children, like spiritually took one of your children. This person could have cared about you, could have had a really close relationship. Somebody did witchcraft over that. They wanted to break your heart. They wanted you to just be destroyed. They hated your light because they knew that if you had made it to this level, that you would shed light on a lot of darkness and set a lot of people free. I just heard set the captives free. Damn, this is crazy. What's up with this three of swords? Yep, Aries collaborated yep listen <sighs> there was an Aries involved this could have been the spiritual practitioner this person was collaborating this could have been a friend of theirs these people got connections they can get on the phone and call somebody in Nigeria get spirits get gins get whatever the hell they want whatever the hell they wanted they got it and now they got all these possessions they're too old to drive all these cars they sitting in this house the woman barely goes out He's done so many isolation spells on her, siphoning her energy that after 30, 40 years, she don't even know who the hell she is. She's a puppet. He's a puppet. She's She was working him first, and then he started working her. Now they're working together, trying to fight the devil. How the hell are you going to get away from the devil when the devil then came to collect, boo? The devil is here. Ain't nothing else to say. The chariot is a moving forward energy. It's nothing else to say. Whoever this practitioner is, thank you. They're moving forward. They're like, hell no. I'm about to get out of this. This is crazy. I'm not taking no more of your money. I don't want it. I'm good. You got me in some spiritual hell that now I got to figure out how the hell I'm about to live out all of these karmic ass life cycles. Yeah, this person is leaving. The fool actually represents a fool. This person tried their hand at the dark arts. The fool represents taking a leap of faith. Yeah. They're watching you being your wishes being fulfilled. They're spying on you. That's it. They are doing it in a sneaky and deceptive way. Somebody could be watching you um, by way of Facebook, by way of a platform, by way of Instagram, YouTube, wherever you add, wherever you are, divine being, they're spying on you. And they're watching you being celebrated in the ethers by people that are very, very powerful. I just heard blood, sweat, and tears. You got it, honestly. You got, you got everything that you deserve, honestly. These people ultimately betrayed you. It was a failed ass attempt and they know it and they're done. I cannot make this up. Ten of Swords is ultimate, ultimate betrayal from people that you would have never expected. People that you had love for. You could absolutely be a water sign, possibly a Pisces or you got Pisces highly aspect in your chart. But this represents a failed plan right here for me. Ten of Swords is saying everything is fine. What they tried to do to you failed. You're still a star. And now the devil has come to collect. These people sacrifice you to the devil. They will burn in hell. I just heard that. Listen. Meanwhile, the Ace of Cups is backing you. The helping hand of the Most High. You got the God of the gods of all the gods and the devil. The devil's coming to collect. These people cannot believe it. These are some real powerful ass people that did some real dark stuff to children. Siphoning the children's power. They want grandchildren just so they can take their power. They crazy. 
trying to offer up other people to the devil. The devil is like, nah, I don't want that. The devil came to collect their ass this time. They have offered up everything. They're now offering up each other. Okay, I'll give you my husband. Okay, I'll get behind the other one's back. Like there's no loyalty amongst these demonic ass thieves. They tried to rob, steal, kill, and destroy you. There's nothing else to say. The Ace of Cups is the helping hand of the Most High God. The, but God is like, but uh, okay. Mm, mm, mm. Child, I don't even know what to say. Mm, this is, I just channel the energy. Ooh, baby. Show me what I need to see, what I need to mother freaking see, honey. This is what they're saying. This is what they got to say, y'all. Home. You're the missing puzzle that makes me feel right at home. These people want you to come back. They're sorry. They're saying, yes, we're sorry. Mm. Well, this is the message. Whoever you are, whoever I'm talking to, listen, I just want to send you some love and light. This is one of few cases that I've ever had to channel by way of spiritual justice and or judgment. A lot of what they did to you, I was being guided by spirit to be very respectful to your privacy. But what I revealed was enough for you to know that this is your story, okay? You are strong. You have healed. You are powerful. And guess what? You never had to sell your soul to the devil. These people even did something to try to make you go into the dark side, like to draw you into the dark arts. Like they only wanted you to meet dark ass, you know, men and just weird just to turn you just to take your light and demolish it. You know what I mean? This is like a mother giving up her daughter to be spiritually raped. It's disgusting. I hope you never see these people again in this life. Even though you're caring, loving, and kind, okay? I hope you never have to encounter these people again. Not by way of the spirit realm, not way of the literal realm. They're holding on to you for dear life, okay? The person that they turned against you look, seems to be a child. That child is no longer, okay? They tried to sacrifice this child. This child has its own lineage. This child is now going through their own awakening. But this child is of age enough to where they can make a certain decision. You could have tried to help this child is what I'm getting. Whoever you are, my heart goes out to you. You know, this is deep. I couldn't, I couldn't imagine having to go through nothing like this, y'all. This is crazy. These people are wicked. They're dark. They do weird ass stuff. They sleep with each other's wives through each other's bodies. I see a Haitian witch doctor. I see a crazy ass doctor from the Ivory Coast. I see some dark ass, dark, dark black man with these piercing blue eyes that's just chanting and doing all these weird ass incantations. Just weird, you know? This man has also offered up this queen of cups to other warlocks like they slept with her by way of the spirit realm and raped her. Okay, so if you believe that this is still your mother, she's not your mother. She hasn't been for a really long time. They only kept her around because she was connected to you and that was the way they accessed you. This is your message though, okay? As I close this door, I send you peace, love, and light. I call upon the healing angels to just help you ascend to your highest good and break these generational curses. I know that you are. I can feel that. Mm, until the next video, as always, peace be with you.